I mean, one of these is a 32 back again, and this is one hell of a way to start off the week. Well, for weeks worth of unboxings in one day, <laughs> I was not expecting this many. I was expecting two packages today, possibly three. I got five. <laughs> so let's start off with this one. This was sent out by Gambler's Warehouse. It is from Sinise Taba. The uh, standard edition of the Caleb Valla playing cards, which is basically the same as the other one, aside from a slightly different top face, and it's printed by the USPC, this variation. The other one is printed by, I believe, WJ PC. Next up, uh, yeah, thank you very much to uh, Sinise for that. He sent me that. Took a while to get the postal list used, but it's finally here. <laughs> uh, next, I got this one, which I believe is from Dead on Paper. Yes. Dead on Paper, there's a receipt thing, or a packing slip. There is a thank you, which is actually a one of the tarot cards from one of his other decks, the Chariot, to be exact. That's pretty cool. And there is... Black paper. Two decks. This is from the, his last Kickstarter project. Chris of the Ankle, the designer, the creator. And this is the Ecliptic playing cards, Zodiac playing cards. This one is not actually in cellophane. That's unusual. Was it autographed or something? I'm not sure. That's weird. This one is not in cellophane. It just feels like it's been open at it. I don't know why that is. Oh, because it's hand numbered. Four, six out of three thousand. This one has no number. So, we got that. We got this is from Bomb Magic. One of the ones I was expecting. I was expecting this one. This one. I knew it was coming, I didn't know when, it wasn't tracking, and I was expecting this one from Order Play. So this is from Bomb Magic. Surprisingly not in a black envelope like they usually do. For some reason I haven't gotten my knife yet. So this is probably going to be it for this week, I would imagine. I mean, I might still get something else, but at this point I'm kind of hoping not. And we have first the Casino Royale uh, Refined Edition, which they sent me a while back. It's a plastic deck. They sent me a while back with one of my orders, but now they've sent me the one I pledged for on Kickstarter. And the other one I pledged for on Kickstarter, which I've been waiting for, which is the Elite Edition. The Casino Royale, also plastic. Then I got this one from... Art of Play, the packing slip, and one deck. Kind of wish I had waited until Black Friday for this, but I thought there's no way it's going to be available still, and it's still available as I checked. It is the new Silver Edition Podo playing cards. There's also a sticker that came with that for Art of Play. It's an elephant for some reason. And lastly, I got one here that is also from Kickstarter. It is from Sky Member Presents. I forgot this was a custom tuck case. It is the, um, that. <laughs> the Olympians playing cards, actually, is what it's called. And it's got. Ah, huh, interesting tuck case. It opens like that, like a book almost. Very interesting. I'm sure that's going to rip off right away. Um, there is an autograph. It is numbered 710. So that is that for the today and possibly this week. Get back in there. Yeah, so this opens up like this. It's very interesting. It's like a book. That is that. Comment, rate, subscribe. Uh, well, I mean, we'll see. There might be more this weekend, and we'll see you next time.